Y good evening, Eliseo. Hello. Good evening. Ah, Hi. okay. I'm okay. How are you? Tell me. I am great. Thank you. Okay, now your connectivity is better, right? Because it is yes. not raining. Okay, yes. great. And how was your day? I think my health I had problems yesterday. Mm -hmm. But now it is okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. And today, how was your day at work? Everything okay? Well, uh, today it was my day off. Oh, and great. Excellent. So you are relaxed. Yes? Yes. Okay. I, mm -hmm. I spent time with my, my daughter mm -hmm. and I practiced um, a lot of my English. Excellent. Very well done. That is the purpose. Okay. So uh, tomorrow you get back to work. Yes. Only one day off yes, uh, in the week. Ah, your, your shift is going to be at night. Okay. So tomorrow you're going to get connected from work. Yes. Yes. Ah, okay. Great. And where do you work? Yes. Where do you work? Where do I you work, work Eliseo? I work at Ternova in, in Plan de la Laguna. Ah, okay. That's interesting. I don't know, if you, I, know I don't know if you know that place. Plan de la Laguna, yes, but there are many companies in there, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So that's interesting. But you live in San Salvador or Santa Tecla, something like that, yes? Yes, Santa Tecla. Ah, okay. It is very close to your workplace. Excellent. Yes, Congratulations. Mm -hmm. And Thank Juan you. Antonio, hello. Welcome. Nice to see you. Welcome back. I am glad that you are here. Okay, great. So class, let's get started because we only have one hour while the other partners join. Okay. So here I'm going to start sharing my screen with you and here we go okay so let's see um if you remember class well if you were here yeah yesterday if you remember we were practicing with this conversation and also if you remember we were also uh, focusing on the verbs in past tense in this conversation, correct? And uh, we were listening and practicing and speaking, but also we moved yesterday into this set of questions, right? And you were asking and answering these questions and we were focusing also in the structure of the questions with did, yes? And if you remember the word order, hello, Henry, welcome. Hello, teacher. Hello, welcome, nice to have you here. Okay, so we were saying that. Yes. You may say, this is the word order, right? For example, if I say, did you work, with, did you work yesterday? And then the short answer could be, yes, I did, or we, yes, I did, or in negative, no, I didn't. Do you remember we were working with this yesterday? And also in full answers, we say, yes, I worked yesterday, yes. The idea here is to practice the verbs in past tense or no, I didn't work yesterday. What happens here? When we build sentences in past, we use the modal auxiliary did for all the persons. There is no special person like in present tense with do and does. No, you say, did you, did I, did we, did he, did she, did it, 
did they, yes? And then immediately after the modal auxiliary Jude did, which goes at the beginning, you may say, did they, we use the subject pronoun, okay? Or the, the subject of the sentence. For instance, did they, um, did they eat beans this morning? Did they, if you notice, the verb goes in the base form, okay? It is not in past tense because what gives you the idea of the past tense is the modal auxiliary did, right? And then the answer should be in affirmative. Tell me short answer. Yes, I did. No, because the subject is they. So we say yes. The subject is they. Yes, they did very well. Um, yeah. In negatives, it would be no, they we didn't. Okay, hold it. No, they didn't. Okay, no, comma, they didn't. But this is short answers. But what about if they were full answers? Then we would say, okay, yes, they ate. Yes, they ate beans this morning. Yes, because in this answer, we are not using did. You may say in order to, me more, to be more emphatic, you may say, yes, they did. And here we can also add, but that wouldn't be uh, short, yeah? Because you can say, yes, they did. And then you say, they ate beans this morning, yes? Mm -hmm. So here you have the short answer. Yes, they did. And then the full answer, they ate beans this morning, right? But what about negative? If we say, no, they didn't. No, they didn't eat beans this morning, okay? Notice that here in the negative, we say, no, they didn't. That's correct the short answer, but in the full, in the long answer, you say, no, they didn't eat beans this morning. You cannot say they mm, not eat, no, you have to say they didn't. In the full answer also, you need to say they didn't eat beans this morning, okay? It is different from the affirmative. En el afirmativo, ya no usamos en la full answer, el modal auxiliary did, pero en el negativo sí, a pesar de que sea completa la respuesta, miren, y es, they, no, they didn't eat beans this morning, ¿ok? Sí, y el aspecto a recordar acá es que did para todos los pronombres personales, ¿sí? A diferencia de presente simple, do, for first person singular, second person singular, and uh, for the plurals. But for the third person singular, we use, what do we use? In present, does, yes, does. Do and does for present, but in past, no, did, okay? Let me see. Okay, Jocelyn, let me show you right now, okay? So we say, did, didn't for all the, Subject pronouns in past tense. Is that okay? Yes? Okay, this is part of what we were doing yesterday. And if you have any question, please ask me. Okay? Si hay preguntas, me hacen la pregunta, por favor, sobre eh, did or didn't. Besides that, yesterday, what else did we do? We were working in the platform, if you remember. Yes or no? 
Trabajamos también en la plataforma, si recuerdan, chicos. ¿Ya? And you were asking these questions. Did you go to the beach? Did you go to work yesterday? And so on. ¿Ya? And uh, we were working in the platform, but somebody told me that has a little problem with the podcast. Pero alguien dijo que tenía problemas con el podcast, porque ayer llegamos hasta el check your knowledge. ¿Ya? And here, I have this. We're going to have a kind of feedback in the platform with the, okay, in here. In these lessons, participants will listen to a conversation using past simple. Pay attention for details and pronunciation, okay? And here I'm going to, okay, because this is the one. Okay, so um, the objective. And this is the listening, yeah? This is the podcast. And you have a four questions. Did you all guys did this exercise? ¿Todos ustedes ya terminaron este ejercicio, chicos? Yes or no? Hello? It is... No, teacher. Okay, so I need you to log into the platform because I'm going to play the podcast and you're going to click on the correct answers, okay? I'm going to play it two times and later we're going to discuss. Is that okay? Yes? Okay. Accesen a la plataforma de aprendizaje. And here, 2.6, yes. okay? And I'm going to play it for you. And you just be concerned about listening and focus on the questions. Who had a boring time? Who had a good time? Who met an old friend? And who got home late? If you notice, it is in past, okay? Met is the past tense of meet. Got is the past tense of get and then had obviously the past tense of have and the same okay ready you tell me when you are ready guys so i play the podcast what is the lesson 2.6 2.6 yeah. okay ready 2.6 everyone tell me please so I can play it for you. Yes, ready. Okay, ready? Here we go. Listening. What did you do last night? Part A. Listen to John and Laura describe what they did last night. Check the correct information about each person. So what did you do last night, John? Uh, I went to my boss's house for dinner. Really? How was it? Oh, the food was okay, but the people weren't very interesting. They talked about football all night, and I hate football. Then we watched some boring sports videos. I didn't get home until after midnight. Well, that doesn't sound like much fun. I had a great time last night. I went to a party and met an old school friend of mine. We haven't seen each other for years, so we had lots to talk about. We stayed at the party all night. Hmm, it sounds like you had a much better time than I did. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay, one more time. Here we go. Listening. What did you do last night? Part A. Listen to John and Laura describe what they did last night. Check the correct information about each person. So, what did you do last night, John? Uh, I went to my boss's house for dinner. Really? How was it? Oh, the food was okay, but the people weren't very interesting. They talked about football all night, and I hate football. Then, we watched some boring sports videos. I didn't get home until after midnight. Well, that doesn't sound like much fun. I had a great time last night. I went to a party and met an old school friend of mine. We haven't seen each other for years, so we had lots to talk about. We stayed at the party all night. Hmm, it sounds like you had a much better time than I did. Yeah, I guess you're right. Is that okay, or do you want me to play it one more time? 
Okay, one more time. Here we go. Listening. What did you do last night? Part A. Listen to John and Laura describe what they did last night. Check the correct information about each person. So, what did you do last night, John? Uh, I went to my boss's house for dinner. Really? How was it? Oh, the food was okay, but the people weren't very interesting. They talked about football all night, and I hate football. Then, we watched some boring sports videos. I didn't get home until after midnight. Well, that doesn't sound like much fun. I had a great time last night. I went to a party and met an old school friend of mine. We haven't seen each other for years, so we had lots to talk about. We stayed at the party all night. Hmm, it sounds like you had a much better time than I did. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay, class, now let's see. Okay. Um, who had a boring time? Lara, John, or both? John. John, very well. Excellent. Who had a good time? Laura. 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 Who met an old friend? Laura. Laura. And who got home late? Laura, John, or both? Both. Both of them, because she says that uh, after, no, he, yeah, after, no, he got home after midnight. And she said that she stayed there uh, all night long. So it means after midnight, right? Okay, very well. So we did it. And now we move to the next one in here. Okay. You will have the chance to listen to a conversation where the past of be is used. Now let's listen to this conversation. Here we go, class, okay? Because I'm going to play it full for you. Uh, if you are so nice, please uh, turn the microphones off so everybody can listen to the audio. Thank you. I appreciate. Participants will have a chance to listen to a conversation with Pastor B if used. Hi to all. Welcome to this session. We'll continue talking about simple past, but now I want you to find out the simple past of B. Listen to the conversation and figure it out. Don't miss next class where I'll explain the pass of B. Let's listen. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. Let's wait. And one more time. No. We were in the over here, it is the one, this is the one, okay. One more time, class. Here we go. Participants will have a chance to listen to a conversation with Pastor B if used. Hi to all, welcome to this session. We'll continue talking about simple past, but now I want you to find out the simple past of B. Listen to the conversation and figure it out. Don't miss next class where I'll explain the pass of B. Let's listen. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. 
So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. You won't believe it. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to practice this conversation. Okay, you have it in your, mm -hmm. let me see if I can share it with you class. Okay, yeah, there you are. And now we move to the breakout rooms in order to practice that conversation, yes? Remember to switch roles. And here, let's see, we have two characters, but I'm going to, let's see, three, 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 okay. You're going to be in groups of three, so you switch roles. It is about uh, vacations and try to practice as much as possible. Do you have any question about the activity or about the pronunciation or something like that? No? No. Okay, excellent. So right now I am opening the breakout rooms. Let's take advantage of our connectivity, okay? So please join your groups and practice the conversation. Join your groups if you are so nice. I need Dennis in group number two. Your partners are waiting for you. And Juan Antonio, I need you in group number three. Juan Antonio, please join group number three. And Dennis, please go to group number two. Dennis, go to group number two. And Juan Antonio, Juan, I need you in group number three. Okay. okay, here you are. Would you please begin with the practice? Uh, the three of you, you work in the same place and you are at work. Okay, let's begin, take turns and begin okay. with the practice, okay? If you want to share the screen, feel free to do it. Begin, please. Okay. Who is going to get started? Yeah. Yes. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? Hello. Who is going to practice with you, Jocelyn, Eliseo or Eliseo. Catherine? Eliseo. Okay, Eliseo, please. She's waiting for your answer. It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Look at you, how long. ¿Quién va a empezar? Que empiecen ustedes dos ahorita después conmigo. Ok. Espérame un momento. Bueno. I don't know how was your vacation. It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Look at you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time, but we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. 
So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You want to believe it. Cambiamos los roles antes, cambiamos los roles. Hi Don, how was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii. Well, well, something incredible happened. Uh, well, something incredible happened. You won't. You won't believe believe it. Believe it. Believe it. Mm -hmm. Believe it. You won't believe it. Uh, you won't believe it. Hoy, si quieres, vos haces lo de Celia y yo voy a decir lo de Don. Bueno. Hi, Don. How are you? the trip? Well, something incredibly happening. You won't believe her. Okay. Va, ahora, ahora cambiaríamos. Well, well. Muy bien. Muy bien, y que sea la Celia. Y vos sería yo. Dennis Reed Celia. Celia Cruz. Eh, ¿Vas a seguir vos o sigo yo? Yo. Dale. Pues. Ah, empezá, Dani. Ay, ahorita. Ay, don Howard, your vacation. It's gone excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Look you, how long were you there? A good, a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? No, really. No, really. I, it's glad it's cloudy most of the time. But go with surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, so time incredibly happening. You won't believe it. Okay. Yo voy a ser Celia. Yo voy a ser Don. Yes. <laughs> ok, begin, guys. Voy, pues. Dale. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Look, Joe, how long were you there? About, with, about a week. Fantastic. Was the word okay? Not really. It was cool most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The was were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Everybody practiced. Everybody interpreted Celia. Everybody played the role of Celia. Yes. Todos yes. eh, participaron leyendo los diferentes personajes. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, teacher. Okay, great. Now let's get back to the main session room in order to continue. Okay. Thank you for teacher. your participation. Yes, sir. And you pronounce it. Mm. What did you say? And you say. What do you want me to say? 
todos, señor, como. Ah, you want me to read the, the conversation for you? Okay, hold it. Because sí. I feel, okay, hold it for a second. Uh, I'm going, Eliseo is having problems with his connectivity. Okay, hold it. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. Hi, Don. How are, how was your vacation? How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin, with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you, that word, lucky, the you sounds like an, a soft A, como una A muy suave, okay? Lucky you. Hmm. I'm going to mute you. Okay, so here, okay? Lucky you, how long were you there? How long were you there? About a week, about a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Was the weather okay? Not really, not really. It was cloudy most of the time, but we went surfing every day, but we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. You know, the waves, las olas, right? The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something, something, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. You won't believe it. So it means that the conversation continues, right? Because he asked, what was the best yeah, um, of the trip? Something incredible happened. Incredible happened. Okay. Questions? Comments? No? About the word or something like that? No. Okay. Let's get back. Thank you. I'm going to close the breakout rooms. Here we go. Let's get back. Thank you, Edward, for being the first one coming back. Okay, now one. Let's wait for the others so we can continue. Okay, class, now we're going to continue and we're going to move to the next activity because time flies. Okay. Let's see who else is missing, nobody. Okay, let's continue then. Okay, here with the platform, okay. This is what we practiced yesterday. This is how was your vacation. And now we move to the next one, okay? In this session, participants will study the past of the questions and short answers will be taught. This is what we began yesterday and it is what we have today, okay? As our objective too, because yesterday we practiced with did, and at the end of the class, I began asking you some questions with uh, the past tense of be. So here we go, okay? 
and we have the objective. Participants will have a chance to listen to a conversation where the past of B is used. And, okay, the topic, the past tense of B and questions and short answers. That is what we're going to move over right now. And here we go, okay. Let's pay close attention if you are so nice. Look at this. This is an explanatory video. Yeah. In this session, participants will study the past of B. Questions and short answers will be taught. Hello, nice to have you back. I'll make reference of the past of the verb B. Let's start. Past of B. Were you in Hawaii? Yes, I was. Was the weather okay? No, it wasn't. Were you and your cousin on vacation? Yes, we were. Were your parents there? No, they weren't. How long were you away? I was away for a week. How was your vacation? It was excellent. Contractions. Wasn't equals was not. Weren't equals were not. The past of be, am um, and is, was, are, were. To ask questions using the past of be, we do it this way. Was, were, plus subject, plus complement, plus question mark. Were you my student? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Was she sad? Yes, she was. No, she wasn't. Were they late? Yes, they were. No, they weren't. Remember, we used be to express feelings, conditions, states, and descriptions, either in present or past. Now you try answering the following questions. Were you my student before? Were you happy yesterday? Were you late this morning? Okay, class, I need you to focus on this um, three questions, okay? Were you my student before? If I ask you this question, class, okay, Jocelyn, were you my student before? The no, answer is no, I wasn't very well. Edward, Eduardo, were you happy yesterday? Were you happy yesterday? No, it weren't. No, 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 no. Were you happy yesterday? No, no I, I were. No, I, no, I wasn't. I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Yeah, this okay. is what we're going to. Okay. Uh, now, Henry, were you late this morning? Were you late this morning? No, I was okay. late this morning. Excellent. That is full answer. But if I ask you, class, in short answer, okay, um, I'm, I'm going to ask you and you tell me the short answer, okay? Were you my student before? Yes, I was, or no, I wasn't. Were you happy yesterday? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Were you late this morning? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Notice that we use where you, but you answer with I because it is a direct question. So we use uh, was for I, and then you say, yes, I was, no, I wasn't. Were you happy yesterday? Yes, I was, or no, I wasn't, in short answer. Were you late this morning? Yes, I was, or no, I wasn't, okay? So, um, and then that's, that's it. Okay, so I'm going to um, explain something to you, class. And if you have any question, please ask me. Feel free to ask me, don't be shy. Okay, here we go. I'm going to, okay. So here, if I, okay, let's see, I, was in past tense, okay? You 
wear. This is the conjugation. You wear. And then we have he was. She was. It was. And then we have mm, we were. Yes. The uh, you in plural. You were and they were, right? This is affirmative. In negative, I was not, you were not, he was not, she was not, it was not, we were not, they were not, they were not. And in negative, I wasn't, you weren't, he wasn't, she wasn't, it wasn't, we weren't, you weren't, they weren't, okay? But if I say, was he, we, what is it? If I say, was he sad last night? Was he sad last night? The answer is, affirmative short answer, yes. We. Oui. Hello, the short answer. Yes, because the question is, was with he. Was he sad last night? Yes, he was. Excellent, very well. Yes, he was. And in negative, no, he wasn't. Yes, okay, very well. And now we continue with the same adjective so you don't get uh, confused. And here, for example, if I say, uh, was she hmm, happy last Sunday? The short affirmative answer is, what is the answer? Yes, she was. Excellent, great. Yes, she was. And in negative, short answer, no. No, she wasn't. Excellent, no, she wasn't. And now, what if I say, this is plural. Were you in my class last night? This is for all my students. So the answer is yes, because my students are a few, yeah? Yes. Where? Yes, we were. Yes, we were. Or no, we weren't. Remember that we use you for singular and plural. And here, were you in my class last night? Yes, we were. No, we weren't. The ones who were absent say, no teacher, we weren't. And the ones who were in class, they say, yes, we were, okay? And then what about uh, where, hmm. where uh, Claudia and let's see. Eliseo in class yesterday. Tell me the, the, the affirmative answer. Yes. Eliseo and Claudia, two people. So it is, which is the subject pronoun? Are you, he, she, we, you, or they? They. Excellent. Yes, they were. We. They. Yes, they yes. were. Were. And in negative? No. No, they weren't. Excellent. Very well. No, they weren't. Okay. Now, remember that we have I was, you were, he was, she was, it was, we were, you were, they were, okay? As it was seen in the video that I played for you from the platform.
okay? And now it is the time for you to practice class. So here we go. And I'm going to share with you here. Yeah, this one. Here, I have these 10 questions, okay? You're going to be asking and answering these questions in the breakout room, okay? Affirmative or negative. And then you try to give short answers, okay? And then you switch roles. Were you home last night? Were your friends with you last Friday night? Was your mother at home yesterday afternoon? Was your sister with you last Monday morning? Were you at the mountains last year? Was your pet with you at the mall? Were you with your relatives last Christmas? Was your exam easy? Was your food delicious at lunchtime? Were you happy in the morning? Okay, these are the 10 questions you are going to be asking and answering, okay? Everybody needs to ask, everybody needs to answer. Questions about the activity? If you have any question, please let me know. No questions. No questions, okay. So I'm going to share this with you, class, via, via WhatsApp, okay? Here we go. Over here, there you are, okay. And now let's move to the breakout rooms. Okay, here we go. Join to your groups, please. Go to your groups and begin asking and answering, okay? Join your groups and ask and answer the questions. Eliseo, I need you in group number one, thank you. Juan Antonio, I need you in group number two. Catherine, please go to group number three. Denise, I need you in group number four. Denise. Dennis, I need you in group number four. Catherine, go to group number three, please. Catherine. Uh, Juan hello. hello, Catherine. I need you in group number three, please. Group number three. And Juan Antonio, I need you in group number two. Group number two. Antonio, Catherine. Uh, Eduardo, your partner is, let me see, Catherine, and she's at work. She's trying to log in, okay? Otherwise, I'm going to send you to another group so you can practice. Um, okay, I'm going to send you to another group. Is that okay? Okay, go to group number two. Uh, Hello, class. Here you are, Eduardo Ortiz, Henry, and Juan Antonio. Okay. Consider Edward, Henry, and Juan Antonio. Begin, please, because time's lying. Eh, preguntas o pregunto? Como que era, Rick. Va, pues voy a preguntar la primera yo, y después la, la segunda hoy. Acá, acá también está Eduardo. Eduardo está con ustedes. Le pueden preguntar a él también, ¿ok? Vale, vamos a hacer una y una. Ok, ah, great. Eh, la primera. Were you home last night, Claudia? Hi. Were you home last night, Claudia? 
Claudia, your answer. Claudia, yes, I was or no, I wasn't. Hello? No, I wasn't, okay. Gabby, were you home last night? The last year, man. Catherine, I alone. Catherine is alone. Ah, uh, because she yeah. went late. So I had to move. Catherine is not in her group. Catherine no se ha unido al grupo, <laughs> al grupo 3. Por eso tuve que mover al compañero a otro equipo. Acá me aparece que no está. Okay, but I'm going to move. Catherine is alone. Lonely the lonely, pues sí, en el, en el main session room. <laughs> <laughs> ah, dígale que le toca irse al equipo número tres. El equipo tres, dice. Yes. Ajá, Caterin. Mire, su compañero espera que espere y Katherine nada que aparecía. Lo, lo tuve que mover a él a otro equipo. Entonces, la voy a enviar a usted a otro grupo para que practiquen, ¿ok? Ahí la voy a enviar con Abel y con Tenis. Sí. <risa> Bye, yes. 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 No problem. yes. Thank you for answering. Ay, no. Ok, move to group number four. Vaya, el equipo cuatro. Pay close attention to the invitation. On the table. Okay. Where did you come last okay. night? No, I was. I am working. Hey. Internova. Hello, who is going to ask the questions to Catherine? Uh, the next one. Number two. Were you friends with your last Friday night? Friday, Friday night. Friday night. Friday night. Yes, I was. No, 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 said, no, listen. I, where? I said, yes, where? No. My friend. No. Okay, which no. question is that one? I'm going to share it with you. Uh, number two, were your friends with you last Friday night? They, She is asking you about your friends, if your friends were with you. And then you say, yes, they were. No, they weren't. Okay. Yes, yes, they were. Okay, good. Mm. Um, the next one. No. Was your sister with you last Monday morning? Abel. Mm -hmm. Yes, they... No, number no. four. He asked you number four. He said, was your sister yes, with you last Monday? Yes, he is. No, because it is sister. Sister. Yes, she. Okay. Is okay. is your... Is, huh? Yes. Yes, yes, we were. Yes, no, she is. No, no. yes, she is, was. Is she? Yes, she was. Miren, ustedes están prestando la atención a lo que está contestando el compañero en el otro equipo, en el otro grupo. Entonces sería, was your sister with you last Monday morning? Yes, she was. No, yes, she, she was. 
Ajá, because your sister is a she, tu hermana. No le tienen que decir he, ¿verdad? Entonces es yes, yes es, she was, no she was. Yes, she. Yes, she was. Ok. Ajá, continue. Ok, number, number five. Were you at the mountains last year? Teacher. Yes. In Spanish, mountains. Where you at the mountains, montañas? In is, in las montañas? No, it's, no, it's, ah, Listen, were you at the mountains last year? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Yes, I was. Okay. Number six. Was your pet with you at the mall? The question goes to Dennis or Catherine. I am, I am a question. Okay. Who is going to answer? Was your pet with you at the mall? Was your pet with you at the mall? Pet, la mascota. Tu mascota estaba contigo en el... ¿En el centro comercial? No. No, I was. No, porque están hablando de la mascota, de tu mascota. Le están preguntando si tu mascota estuvo contigo en el centro comercial. Was your pet with you at the mall? No, it wasn't. Porque ¿cuál, no, es, el it, nombre, it wasn't. Mire, ¿cuál es el pronombre personal que utilizamos para pet? Mascota, una mascota. It, it, uh -huh. it, it, no, it wasn't very well. No, it wasn't. Okay, now continue. Okay. Uh -huh. Esta, la número siete. Yo okay. se las pregunto. Al, uh, yo le hago la pregunta y los tres me contestan. Were okay. you with your relatives last Christmas? Were you with your relatives last Christmas? ¿Estabas con tus parientes en Navidad pasada, la última Navidad? Were you yes, they, 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 they were. They were. No, porque acá, were you, estabas tú con tus parientes. Te estoy preguntando a ti si tú estabas con tus parientes. Las Christmas. No. Yes. Yes I, yes, I was. Yes, I was. No, I was. <laughs> Debemos saber cuál es el sujeto de la oración. Ok. Ok. Now, uh, Catherine, read question number eight and Abel is going to answer. Okay. Question number eight. Catherine, read question number eight. Was your exam is easy? Easy? Abel. No, I wasn't. No, porque no te estoy preguntando sobre ti. Estoy preguntándote <laughs> sobre tu examen. Your exam. Was mm. your exam easy? Uh, no, it was. Excellent. No, it wasn't. Este verbo <laughs> okay, okay, teacher. Okay, Abel, now you read question number nine and Dennis is going to answer. Okay. Where you put the issue a long time? Dennis, the answer. Yes, Dennis. it was. Yes, it was. Very good because I am asking you about your lunch, the food, yeah? And yes. Dennis ask question number 10 to Catherine. Okay. Were you happy in the morning? Yes. Catherine. Yes, I was. Okay. Oh my God. The verb to be, we need to practice more the verb to be. It was harder than the other verbs in past tense. Ok, let's get back. Miren, practiquen en la plataforma, por favor. Ok, y si hay problema, okay. lo vamos a resolver mañana. Ya ven, por haber estado ausente un par de días, miren. Oh my God. It's time. Let's get back to the main session room. Ok. Ok. okay. Well, 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 
um, I'm going to ask you to activate your cameras because right now you are going to be asking and answering the questions here, okay? The questions that you were practicing so we can close the class like this, okay? Practicing with uh, answering with short answers, okay? Edward, where are you, Eduardo? Eduardo, ask question number one to one of your classmates. Question number one, read question number one and say the question goes to, and you say the name of the partner. Solo estoy buscando la, la imagen que me salió. <laughs> Via WhatsApp. Sí. Okay. Uh, okay, este, Jocelyn, where were you home last night? Yes, I was. Okay, thank you, Jocelyn. Okay. Question number two. Read question number two and say the name of the partner. The question goes to Abel. Abel, your opportunity to shine. Were your friends with your last Friday night? Abel, you are the star. It is your moment. Question yes, number I two. No, because it is question number two. Were your friends with you? Were your friends with you? Yes, I will. No. Yes, they were. Y ahí estaban blowing, but no, no effect. Yes. They were or no, they were it. Okay, now Abel, read question number three, and you say the name of the partner. Okay, teach. Henry. Henry. Hello. What's your mother at home yesterday afternoon? Yes, 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 she was. Yes, she was. Very good. Congrats. Now, Henry, question number four. And you say the name of the partner. Claudia. Claudia, get ready. Number three. Number three. But it's... No, number four. Okay. Your yes. sister. What's your sister? With you last Monday morning. Claudia, was your sister, was your sister with you last Monday morning? Yes, she was, yes, she was. or no, she wasn't. Okay. Yes, she was. Yes, she was. Now, Claudia, ask question number five. Claudia. No, okay. Teacher. Read question number five and choose your victim. Para Eliseo. Eliseo. Hi. Were okay. you at the Long, long times last year. No, I wasn't. Excellent. Now, Eliseo, you ask the question, question number six to another partner. Okay. For Gabriela. <laughs> Again, second chance. <laughs> they victimize you. <laughs> ah, and she, she was. Okay, no, continue. Okay. Yeah, but ask the question because. Okay. I... Was, just, was your pet with you at the mall? Yes, I was. The pet, was the pet with you? Yes, at the it was. Yes, it was, very well. Now you, uh, Jocelyn Gabriela, ask the question to Juan Antonio. Question number seven. Where do with your relatives, relatives. Last, relatives last Christmas? Juan Antonio. Eh, 
Yes, I was. Mm -mm. No, because she's asking. She's asking. Uh, oh, yes, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Okay. Were right. you with your relatives? <laughs> yes, I was. Okay. Sí, porque le está preguntando si usted estaba con sus parientes. Yes, I was. Now you, Juan. Juan, ask question number eight to, to Catherine. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You are very mean, Abel. Uh -huh. Was your food delicious at lunch time? Catherine. Yeah. Yes, yes, it was. Yes, it was. Excellent. You're very good partners. Now, Catherine, ask question number eight to Abel. Uh, <laughs> was the exam easy? Was your exam easy? Number eight, was your exam easy, Abel? <laughs> blowing, blowing. <laughs> the wind, the winds. <laughs> no, it was. No, it wasn't. And the question is for everybody. Class, were you happy in the morning? Yes. Yes. I pregunto, okay, yes, I was if it was individually. But if I ask, hey class, were you happy in the morning? Then you say, yes, we were, no, we weren't. Fíjense que la clave acá está en identificar quién o cuál es el sujeto, porque ese sujeto lo vamos a sustituir por un pronombre personal, ¿de acuerdo? Y ahí veremos si es singular, was, si es plural, where, ¿ok? Class, thank you very much for being here. Please join to the class tomorrow, ¿ok? Have a good Teacher. night and continue working Teacher. with the platform. Yes, Abel. Un momentito, fíjense que... A mí me, me ocurrió algo ahí en la plataforma. No sí. sé si a los demás les ha ocurrido, pero Ajá. todas las actividades se me borraron. Ajá. Me parece a cero todo. Uh, y pero ya, había, su... ya, ya tenía hecho la semana uno, la dos y la Ajá. tres. Sí, yo recuerdo. Y ahora... Que Mire, y le dio submit, submit, submit. A todo, enviar, sí. enviar, enviar. Fíjense sí, todo que se, se supone que queda archivada esa información. ¿Verdad? Sí, se ahora que yo... Ahora entré a la plataforma. Y vio el progreso. Y vio el progreso y nada. Mm, ahí solo que como esa es situación técnica, ¿verdad? Se comunique con, con soporte técnico. Envíeles un correo o vía WhatsApp con quienes están acá en el, en el grupo de WhatsApp para que le, le ¿verdad? Le verifiquen, ¿sí? Okay. Porque como ahí aparece que cuando ustedes realizan el trabajo queda archivado. Entonces tal vez Correct. se lo pueden recuperar. ¿De acuerdo? Puede ser que se haya actualizado o haya habido alguna situación y ellos les sabrán explicar, ¿de acuerdo? Sí, porque yo okay. recuerdo que usted sí era de los que me decía que ya iban avanzando y todo lo demás, ¿de acuerdo? Ok. Mm. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Bye, bye. Have a good night. Blessings. Bye. Bye, bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Hope to see you tomorrow, ¿ok? See good you night. tomorrow, hopefully. Good night. Bye, bye. Good bye. night. Have a good night, sweet dreams. Bye bye, Juan. Bye bye, Chastelin Gabriela. Bye bye. Bye. Have a good night, Juan Antonio. Good night. Have a good night. Bye bye. Leave the room.